In this video, we're going to look at how to find the area of a circle. The area of a circle is given by the formula pi r squared. Just remember that whenever you're working this out, you square before you multiply. So you square the radius and then times it by pi. So if you had a circle and you were given the radius of the circle, so the distance from the center to the edge, to find the area of the whole circle, you square that value, the, distance, or the value of the radius, and you times it by pi. Let's have a look at an example. So here we've got a circle and we've got this circle and the circle's got a radius of seven. So the area equals pi r squared. So that's gonna be pi times the radius, which is seven squared. Well, seven squared is 49, so that's pi times 49. And then on your calculator, now you just need to do pi times 49. So the pi button is here, just above the center one here at the bottom. So you press shift and then you press that button and then you do times 49. So when you do that, you're gonna get pi times 49 equals a value of 153.93804, and that's centimeters squared. Remember it's an area, so it'd be in centimeters squared. And if we wanted to round this, let's just round it to one decimal place, it's gonna be 153.9 centimeters squared to one decimal place. Okay, so to find the area of a circle, you just square the value for the radius and times it by pi. If you were doing this on a non-calculator paper and you had to do pi times 49, sometimes the question asks you to leave your answer in terms of pi. So just like in algebra, if you were to do uh, pi times 49, you just put it together and the answer would be 49 pi. Okay, let's have a look at another question. So this time we've got a circle and this time the diameter of the circle is eight centimeters. So area equals pi r squared. So the area will equal pi times the radius. Now the radius is halfway across the circle. So if the diameter the whole way across it is eight, the radius would be four. So it's gonna be pi times four squared. Four squared is 16, so it's pi times 16. And then on your calculator, just work that out. So pi times 16 is equal to 50, 0.265 and so on and then just round it to one decimal place would be 50.3 centimeters squared to one decimal place okay and that's how you find the uh, area if you were given the diameter okay let's just have a look at one last question this time we've been given a circle and we've been given the area is 50 centimeters squared and it says calculate the radius r so the area is pi r squared so area equals pi r r squared so normally we would square it and times by pi so if we wanted to work backwards we would divide by pi and then square root it so we're going to do 50 divided by pi and if we do 50 divided by pi we get an answer of 15.915 so on i uh, don't round that so that's what the radius square would, uh, squared would be. So now we just need to square root that number, 15.915, so on. So we just square root that, and that'll give us the radius. So the radius, r, is equal to 3.989, so on, centimeters. Okay, so to find the area of a circle, use the formula pi r squared. You square the radius and then times it by pi. So an example would be, here we had seven, so we square that, it's 49 times about pi, and we get the area of the circle. If you're given the diameter, you need to half it first to get the radius, then square it times about pi. And if you needed to work backwards and find the radius, instead of squaring it in times about pi, you divide by pi and then square root it, and then you'd work out your answer. And that's it. Um, if you want to see a video on um, area of a circle, a quick easy way to, to remember it, go on to corporatemaths.com and look up uh, circumference song or circle song.